All right. So I'm at a little bit farther of the game compared to last time because it didn't record right or whatever. So I'm a little bit ahead of my last video. And basically, I tried to blow up this big ass thing. It's part of the PKs and it didn't blow up. The bombs went off, but it wasn't enough to take the whole thing down. So now the old guy made me some bomb that has a timer instead of uh, us blowing it up from far away. It's on a timer, so I got like two minutes to climb to the top of this fucking thing. Okay, two minutes and maybe 45 seconds of game? I don't know. Two minutes and something. But, most likely, it's gonna take me a while to get it right. Because I'm pretty sure you miss one jump, you're back at the bottom, and you're not gonna be able to get it in time. So we'll see how this goes. Shit, I could have jumped on that bar. Now I gotta wait. Guy, oh shit. Oh, my God, I made it. Now, what? Now, what? Now, what? Really? I gotta go up more? Unbelievable. So what is there to even climb on? Oh, word. Now what? Are you kidding me? You gotta be shitting me. What the fuck was I supposed to do? Unbelievable. Now I gotta do the whole goddamn thing again. It's effing bullcrap, I tell ya. I'm sorry, I really try not to swear a lot. I just do. And my kid's not here, so... When my kid's home, I gotta watch it. He's not here right now, so... Fuck, 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 fuck! Right here. Come on, come on, come on. Faster. Go oh, you. Oh, thank God. Get up there, get up there. Now, what do I gotta do? Climb more? I gotta go up more? I got this though, I think I can do it. Yeah! So what do I do? What am I doing here? Oh shit, didn't even see this. Get up the 
Come on, come on, come on! Go, go, go! No, what am I doing? Uh-oh. What are you doing, you nut? Oh, cool, he did the army splash. No! Hands down, amazing. Hello? Hey, Alberto? I'm coming. You sons of bitches. What have you done to him? Other one at. Come on, Mao. What you got? Where's the other guy? You got fucked up, dude. This is what you get for messing up with an old man. Messing with an old man. Drop. No, that's what I call. It don't matter. Even ah uh, man, I'm old. And you'll just keep getting older. Quit the bullshit, Adam. I'm not that adult. Thanks for helping me. <laughs> I know what they think of me. Of course I know. <coughs> Tell everyone we pulled this off thanks to Vincenzo. Okay. <coughs> That's thanks to you, Alberto. No. Thanks to Vincenzo, okay? They laugh at him. Laugh because of me. <coughs> but no. That we've done this, they won't laugh anymore. See, his his old man's, huh? Not a cook or a or a failure anymore. Aww. Force the peacekeepers to withdraw. Say it was him. Promise me. All right. Okay. Oh, and tell him. Tell him that. That's okay. I'll tell him. That I'm proud. Never told him that. Son, I'm proud of you. That's it. I'll tell him for you. I promise. Oh, I like that old guy. <laughs> I 
You know, I really thought that was gonna take a lot longer. Kinda health kits in my weapon up too. See if I can scrap. Hmm, <laughs> scrap, craft anything. Nada. Fuck it. Oh, excuse me. Hey, hey, night fire will show you put on. Now it's time to blow this popsicle stand. I can't. One thing I still have to take care of. You don't get it. There's no time to waste. We can make our way to the center now. Everyone's too busy to notice. I promised Alberto I'd tell his son something for him. Do you want to finish your business or play shepherd spreading the good word? Well, it's bad news, Hakan. Alberto is dead. I see. But the metro is empty. There might never be another chance like this. Are you sure? I promise. I have to go find Vincenzo, Hakan. I promised. A night fucking errand. Hurry. Remember Sarah and Yana. Find me at their place when you're done. If you're still alive. This is a really, really good game. I, I can't say it enough. I'm trying to talk my buddy into playing it, and he's being very stubborn. But, I mean, I get where he's at. Like, The Last of Us, he got that right away. No hesitation when I told him The Last of Us 2 was fire. He already played the first one, but... This one... Eh, he's hesitant. And then I find out the motherfucker's playing Days Gone. Days Gone is trash compared to this. Some people like it. I can't stand the game. I can't stand the main character. I just can't stand the game. I don't like the zombies. I really can. Good night. Yeah, like I was saying, I can't stand the zombies. I don't like the fact they make their little huts out of shit. I can't stand how he's always whining and complaining about something. This guy seems a little complainy too, but... Definitely way cooler than... I forget the guy's name in that, uh, in Days Gone, but... My point is, is he'll play Days Gone, but he won't even give this one a chance. There are rumors about a lost Garden of Eden, found under a glass ceiling somewhere on Old Bound Street. But then again, these, uh, this type of game, like I said, I never got into Dying Light 1. I didn't even hesitate to give it a chance. I just wouldn't. I didn't care. It was just not my type of game. But then I watched a little bit of a playthrough when they released a demo of this. I just thought it looked cool. And I liked the whole running shit of it. And then what really sold me was the, uh, the guy had a fucking hang glider. So he freaking uh, jumping off of buildings flying. So I told myself I'm definitely going to try it out. Tried it out. And I've been loving it ever since. Except the whole R1 is jump. I really didn't like that. And I didn't like the fact that I couldn't even change the setup for that. But now I'm used to it. Now it, it fits. Holy shit. I got to kill this guy. <laughs> Run, dude. That was an accident. Nah, I gotta use the health kit. Screw you guys. You weren't my friends anyway. Yeah. <laughs> oh. 
What the hell is that? Oh shit. Oh, you got played only get stuck back here. Where am I going? Whoa! What's going on? Why am I getting all sick here? Look. See ya? How's that big guy still affecting me? I don't get it. This is glitching now like a motherfucker. I think it's a glitch, right? I understand when the big guy like does his like walk or he hits the whole ground shakes, but why is it still shaking? I'll turn this shit off, I have to. He's not anywhere close to me. What did I miss? I don't want the axe. I got enough weapons. wasn't here before. What were you doing? Come on, glitchy glitch. Look. There you go. I want to go to the bazaar. Perfect. Fuck you guys! Oh no. And I need to get that skill where it doesn't hurt when you fall. You can jump from fall. Uh, bigger heights. What's down here? Oh yeah, the Metro. Cleaned up. Didn't put up much of a fight. Yeah, because they're cowards. Told you before. What about the prisoners? Throw them in the dungeon? Unless you feel like banging them first. <laughs> Look. It's Chubbs. They killed Chubbs? Looks like it. But only him, I think. We gotta tell Anderson. Yeah, but where is she? Should have been here ages ago. I'll look for her. I could go for a drink right now. <laughs> Come on. One second. I'm doing something. Okay. Heads up. I got a body. Done. No. <laughs> Let's 
So what, we're killing what PK on sight? Who's the last one? You freak out, Ronas. I thought it was over, man. I can't believe Carl betrayed us. Fuck, Pilgrim. At first I thought you gave us up. But Carl... If it wasn't for him, the peacekeepers wouldn't have attacked. 
but he fled right after the blast. There are more on the upper level. Okay, I'll go there. You run. Really? No one's gonna help me fight? Hold on. Let's see how much time we got left of the video. I have to keep track of the timer because, like I said, I'm recording right off the PlayStation and it gives me 59 minutes and 59 seconds. You know, so I gotta start a timer every time I record. Alright, let me see what we got. Where are they at? Alright, give me one sec. It's funny, I'm basically just talking to myself because nobody really watches the videos yet. She looks like she got a softball in her belly. You think? I don't know. <laughs> it's been like how many weeks? I don't know. Probably. Great. Dude, you ever talk to uh, Joe about that letter or doing in the basement or is he like, no? Yeah. Like really I mean, I bet he already you already got what four cats. Yeah, the other one, literally, he's literally now only having accidents like once every three weeks. Oh shit. Every day. That's why she's being fed down here, not in like the window, anywhere like. And they were also fighting each other <laughs> in the street. So I don't know what the. Future what Pina and another cat. And <laughs> Break it up. We'll see. Uh, All right. We'll see. I don't know. I have friends too who work for uh, Orca that I'm going to try to talk to about it. Cool. Just because that's a lot. Yeah. It's and I know we can't have them running around here, you know. They will be running for like. But eventually they're going to turn into that, which will turn into more babies. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Sorry, I want to put my cigarette out and my neighbor's out front. A female. And she is hot. What other YouTuber will you be watching their video? They press, press pause and then you hear them outside talking to the neighbors and shit. Nobody. This is a strictly Echo Bravo gaming. Hey. Aiden. Thing. Yeah, don't be scared. It's safe now. <sighs> Thank you. Hey, Sophie. So where's Vincenzo? Aiden, watch out! <laughs> Aiden's gonna pay me hella gold for you. Huh? Shit. <laughs> Barney, the my man. Get up, Aiden. Thanks, man. That makes us even. It's not over yet. Aiden! Aiden! Come on, you oh. coward! Come down and fight! You better get out of here, Anderson. You're on bizarre turf. I'll tell Aiden there's still time to call this off. Why would he do that? We're winning. You're stupider than I thought. Come down and fight. And stop using your bizarre buddies as human shields. Aiden, no! God damn it. Someone picking us up and it's. What the fuck was that? Think you can handle Peacekeeper? Fuck is 
Shit, she fucked me up. How am I supposed to fight that? Okay, so no blocking. We're dodging shit. Okay. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? I can block their shit. I'm gonna kill you. Fucking cheap shot. What the fuck? How'd she give me some? Just kill him and we'll try this again. How the fuck are you even supposed to fight that when every hit they get you kills you? She must have a fucking good weapon. Damn. Human enemies are usually quick and hit hard. Try the more tactical approach. Use block, dodge, and available items. Like what? Can't even buy none. What the fuck was that? Fuck! This is bullshit, man. I'm not gonna have any fucking. Where's this bitch at? Are you kidding me? Are you? I jumped out of your way. How the fuck did you hit me? your fucking help. Ain't no honey in this bitch. got nothing I'm dead there's no way I can fucking beat them like this so. Oh, 
Yes, health kits, baby. Oh, it is so on, you fucking bitch. It is fucking on. I'm gonna enjoy. No, you die. <laughs> Damn! We have reports that Ader's men are retreating. The plan worked. We took out their lights and the infected tore them to pieces. They don't stand a chance without him. Ader withdrew his men. They're in the metro tunnels. Holy We're not shit. Getting to the center that way. Carl betrayed us. He's the one who went to the peacekeepers and warned them. Claimed he wanted to prevent bloodshed, but made things worse. But now, I run the bazaar. And I promise, we will defeat Ador, and I will take you to the central loop. Sophie runs the bazaar! For Sophie! <laughs> they know how many PK creeps it takes to screw in a light bulb? None, because they're too dead to screw anything. <laughs> Alberto's dead. <laughs> Don't be a fuzz kill, Aiden. Yeah. <laughs> I'm serious. He was killed taking down the windmill. How'd it happen? We put Vincenzo's plan into motion, but then... Alberto had to go in his son's place. Sacrificed himself to blow up the windmill. Fuck me. To Alberto! To Alberto! So... Where's Vincenzo? He's outside. Look around. Yeah, after I go fucking Bree up, get rid of some shit. Let me, I gotta sell some shit. Am I able to go to any store? So there's no store now. What the fuck am I supposed to do with all this shit? I'm trying to sell it. Great. Let me see what weapon I got from this cunt. Nothing, did I? I didn't win a weapon? I think that's it. That's what I won from her. I need to find somewhere to sell this shit. What about... What else I got? Any new gloves? You know, I can do this shit after I record. You know, you don't want to see that dumb shit. Vincenzo. <laughs> we did it, Aiden. My dad, he really did it. Your father wanted me to tell you, um, he's always been proud of you. Very proud. What? Why are you telling me this and not him? He died, Vincenzo. Died for the bazaar. Was he in pain when he died? No, he was all smiles because of you and because he was able to carry out your plan. Thanks for being there with him, Aiden. Your dad kicked ass, Vincenzo. Yeah, Alberto's all right. Hell of a craftsman. For a loser, you mean. For a failure. That's what you used to say. If only we had more like Alberto, the PKs would have been gone ages ago. You, go in and check on Vincenzo. Now! You did a freaking awesome job, Aiden. We'll beat the PK, and we'll help you get to the center. You're one of us now, brother. You're part of the Bazaar family. Thanks, Barney. Good luck. Good luck, Pilgrim. Hey, Hakon. Where are you? I'm waiting for you at the girl's place. You'd better hurry, Aiden. The passage to the center, it's blocked. I have another 
right here. Just come quickly. Time is not on our side. Okay. I'm coming. I need to find somewhere to sell some of this shit. And I don't want to just put it in a book bag. I want to sell it. How much time we got? UV rest store. Perfect. 40 minutes. Is that the closest one? What's that? Safe zone. Peacekeeper territory. Ooh, I don't know about going there. Store. I guess this is it. This is where we're going. What is that? Why is it red? Huh. Maybe see what this question mark is on the way. Oh, it's about to be nighttime. I'm gonna make a run to it, sell the shit, and then wrap the video. Hello? Hey? Saute the mushrooms, blanch the asparagus. <laughs> Where am I going? That's pretty cool they got a crane just sitting there like that. Is this it? Gotta put that car weasel through the ringer. Oh, he spit out, out who killed Luther right away. Oh shit, it's way over there. about to be dark. <laughs> At first I didn't like how un like how far these jumps were and how unreal they were. You know? Weapon, take the lavender. Give me the poppy, because everybody likes poppy. <laughs> what am I doing with feathers? Just in time, baby. Try telling that. But they got the days are in the plan been filmed since yesterday. Are you? Oh, that's the weapon I want. Oh, that's what they're saying. Stitches. Why is that one ten thousand? That one's. You know, whatever. Find all that. Okay.
4, 8, 12, 16, 20. Peanut, the hell are you doing? Come on, get in the house. Come on, one. Let's go. Peanut, suit yourself. So check this out. Over the winter, my son had some little cat that would come up to us. Well, him, whenever he would go out front. And he would call it peanut. And then the one day, this little fucker ran in the house. I couldn't find it anywhere. And this is like 10, 11 o'clock at night. And I'm tired. I got to work the next day. So I ended up, I was like, all right, I'll just, I'll wait him out. So I fell asleep. I woke up with this little cat sleeping on me. So ever since then, I've been letting it come inside. You know what I mean? It was the winter. It's freaking cold. And uh, basically, I have an inside-outside cat. I don't even have a litter box. You know what I mean? I don't have to. The cat goes to the bathroom outside. Even if it's... I think the cat thinks it's a dog. But now, we're gonna get it neutered, and I didn't get it neutered in time, and the cat's pregnant. Well, first I thought it was a boy for the longest. Nope, it's a girl, and she's pregnant. That's what I was out front talking to my neighbor about. Okay, what did I want to check? Inventory. Damn. Trash, trash, trash. What's my mask? I got a feeling we're getting ourselves into trouble. And we have no other choice. Legend has it the Night Runners built these windmills. Get it here! I'm gonna sell the rest of that shit. But, um, yeah. That's the story of the cat. And now my neighbor's trying to find someone that will take the cat. My kid's mother said she'll take all the baby cats, but I don't want the cat giving birth in here. She pretty much comes inside to eat and sleep sometimes. But when I leave for work, the cat goes outside. If she wants to use the bathroom, the cat goes outside. And listen, I'm like strictly no animals here. I don't really want any pets. I don't want the hair. But this cat's pretty, pretty easy. New stuff. But yeah, I think I'm gonna wrap this video up. Um, thank God I got it done. Oh yeah.